Welcome guys. All right, we've officially tied the knot. We're finishing packing right now. I will be much more presentable the next time you see me, but we're packing up, we're getting ready, and we're heading on our honeymoon road trip. So first stop from um, our home in Florida is going to be Mount Rushmore in South Dakota. So I hope you're ready for this. South Dakota right now. So we've made it through Florida, Georgia, Kentucky, Missouri, Illinois, Iowa. I might be missing some in between, but we're making really good time. And today we are going to um, Mount Rushmore among like a few other attractions that we might find on the way, but that was like our first biggest thing that we were doing um, on our trip, so we're super excited to finally be here. And Coco is loving RV life. Can you see her? Coco! That's her breakfast down there that she needs. She needs to finish her breakfast.
What do you think of the snow, Coco? Little bear prints. By little bear prints, I mean Coco's little prints mixed in with mine. Found this pretty sweet camp spot that has a little paw park and it's off season. So we are the only ones here. I think she's pretty happy. Oh no. <laughs> Actually have our um, campsite here in Yellowstone. I'll show you guys this. Look at how sick is that to like wake up in the morning and walk out, and that's what you see. Oh yeah, I lost the nail. R.I.P. I'm sure I'm going to lose like all of them on the rest of this trip, but it's totally worth it. Step out the RV. How sick. Mm-hmm. 
We are at Old Faithful. Coco is at Old Faithful. <laughs> This is genuinely the best time to come because see all of these seats. I'm sure in season they're full. But right now, they're empty. There are more geysers than just Old Faithful. Justin's gonna throw up. That's why you should eat properly. Ouch. Let's put my phone away. He almost threw up.
on our bike ride and a whole herd. Finished our first random bike ride, and now we're going one Sheep Eater Cliff bike ride. Hopefully Justin won't throw up. Okay. Couldn't bike it, because there's lots of snow. So we're now walking with helmets on, but this view. West end of the park. So this is the west end of the park and tons and tons of geysers. It smells ripe up in here. This one is so hot that the mud is bubbling with the water. There's so much more than Old Faithful out here. It's snowing, but here there's no snow on the ground. Except away from the geysers. Snowy Peak, bubbling mud. I'll shift. You'll see there's a cave right there. It's insane. It's literally freezing outside and snowing, but the geysers are so hot. Like, you pay a lot of money for these mud baths. Insane. So crazy. I don't know if you can hear it or not in the video, but this guy.
We are just a short walk from the geysers. Look at how snowy it is. Proof of how cold it is. Those geysers do not care. Hi, babe. Hi. I'm Joey. <laughs> Yellowstone, epic hiking. It's freezing cold and snowing. Geysers are hot. I don't even know if you can tell how much it's so yeah, you can totally see how much it's sewing right now. It's insane guys. You gotta come. There's people hiking down there. Check it out. These guys are good for miles. All over the park. Alright guys, so obviously, um, like I said, Yellowstone, epic, amazing hiking, everything like that. And we are now headed to Zion. And what's the other one called? Jackson Hole. Jackson Hole. So we'll see you on the next one.